newly appointed Kaiser Chiefs coach at Zwane, affectionately known as 10 triple one said guys please please calm down success doesn't happen overnight this club will not be built overnight and start to succeed overnight no he said guys please relax Kaiser Chiefs is in the building process and you're gonna like what Kaiser Chiefs will become but only if you are patient. And then I was like, wow, Atazone, you are making sense. But then I was like, hmm, that's quite interesting. Good people, do you want to know more about that? Then please stick around. To those that will stick around, guys, if you are not yet subscribed, what are you waiting for? Because to subscribe, it is free. To like the video, it is free. To comment in the comment section below, good people. It is free of charge without wasting much of your time good people there's a button called join and when you see it we'll just check now there's a word called turn to see media below below that there's a button called join please become a member of this youtube channel join others who have become the member of this youtube channel from as little as 20 and 30 and 40 and uh, 50 and 60 and 70 and 80 and a month if also you, you you you're not a member you can also thank uh thank this channel you can donate as much as, as as much as you can. Just check the button called thanks and then you know you're good to go. Nevertheless, as we dive into it, good people. Um Atazwane came out and said, No, guys, please relax. Rome was not built in the day. It's gonna take us time. But also judge us by how the team is playing, how the team is performing. And for me, during Kaza Chief's first five games, what I'm interested to see is how are they playing? How are they applying themselves? It just tells me that, okay, if ever they are building, I want to see a different, every now and then when I watch them, I want to see them improving, improving. In, that's, that's what I'm interested to see. I believe everybody should have paid attention to that. Stop being fixated upon results. Atas has got this to say, lest you say I talk too much. I know you guys are going to come after me <laughs> because you sometimes do that. He says, I think we are still far from where we are, where we want to be. As much as we are, we are building in all aspects in terms of the, in terms of confidence, the way we play, the culture and all those things, it's not going to be something that will happen overnight. It's going to take some time, but that's why we are going to have to go through stages. There are, there are phases that you don't, you, there are phases that you have to make sure you complete, you complete this one first and there and be sure that everybody, everyone is on the same page before you move to the next one. Otherwise, you won't be able to involve, you know, you won't be able to involve everything or everything at once and that will cause sort of division and players won't even know whether they are coming or going. He continues to say, if you have to give a rating out of 10, maybe we are still on 4. We are not even halfway, be, halfway because we still have a long way to go. But yes, yeah, speaking of the real AM game, he said, but I'm, but I'm still saying, uh, what I saw against Real AM, it gave me some um, much hope in terms of the way we, the way players responded, because playing an playing an ex, uh, look, expansive uh, football is very difficult. It comes with a lot of coaching, technical understanding, game intelligence. So we are still far from it. Okay, he continues to say, but I know we are going. We are going to get there. Most definitely because we are trying to kill two bears with one stone. We are not in a hurry to get there. But eventually we're going to get there. Says Uatazwa. Eventually we're going to get there. And I think that's the most comforting words that I can leave you with. But eventually we're going to get there. Out of everything that I've said. When Atazana says eventually they're gonna get there, and I'm I'm I'm, I'm still gonna say, guys, I would rather have you judge Kaza Chiefs based on the results. I mean, based on their performance, are they learning from their previous mistake, improving every now and then? I think that would have been a great idea to judge Kaza Chiefs. Nonetheless, I've got you. You know what I'm saying? You've got me. 
I've started the conversation. It continues in the comment section below. Let the conversation therefore begin right now, right here.